So Full of Hell is back with their third individual studio album. I know there was that album that was pretty much just a Full of Hell record, but it had Merzbow on it. But this is their third in just their name. So Full of Hell is known for taking power violence and infusing some sludgy elements, some harsh noise, and a lot of kind of thematic builds and flows to their albums, despite them being so short. This album is their most direct power violence record to date. Um, and although it is sorely missed as far as noise goes and some of these other influences, they still have some crazy highlights on this album. Nod Flesh being one of those highlights, this is the sludgiest, heaviest track they have ever released. The kind of just building finale is one of the heaviest moments I think I've heard in modern metal music. Like really, it is intense. On the opposite side of the very slow and sludgy Nod Flesh is a cosmic vein, which feels almost black metal or kind of classic metal influence with the guitar solos and the higher pitched wailing screeches. The title track is one of the most confusing songs you will hear from Full of Hell. It is straight up eerie as fuck most of the song. It sounds like vocals lifted from a grinds record suddenly interjected with these harsh noises and these cataclysmic world ending roars and then it switches right back into the super creepy girl singing and I just think it was an excellent show of atmosphere and I think it really shows the dynamics. I kind of wish it showed up a little bit more evenly spread across the album or at least some of these influences but this song is a huge standout. Also pulling from that album they did with Merzbow, I think they effectively used some subtle noise to punctuate certain moments in songs. Certain drops or hits are way more intense than the other parts of the song because they're punctuated with these screeching squeals or some buzzing noises underneath the guitars. So although it does feature some meat and potatoes, grindcore, and power violence, I think this is one of Full of Hell's best records. I don't think it might live up to kind of the huge bar that Roots Consuming My Own set, but I really do think that it is a great power violence record, and it's one of my favorite metal records of the year. I highly recommend checking it out. It's a brutal out of 10. Probably like an 8 though.